What's up guys, it's your boy the Beer for Games here and have you ever wondered how I was able to play the 2026 World Cup with all 48 teams included? Or how I was able to play in the Brazilian league despite them not being licensed in the game? Or how I was able to play with Ricardo Kaká in his licensed original AC blanket? Then you guys have come to the right place. In this video I'm going to show you exactly how to use and download any type of mod out there on the internet for you guys to enjoy your career modes even further. All right, uh, stay tuned. All right, so you go to Google, obviously, and then you type FC25 Mod Manager and obviously see what comes up. Select the first one, FIFA Editing Tool Suite and select Download for Mod Manager version 1.2. I think there's a later version, but this one will do. And it will send you to this link. Obviously, press the green button in the bottom right, click Download and it will come up, it will take a few moments. And then once it's downloaded, you need to actually look for mods. So just look for any mods that are available on the internet. There's so many available. I select this one, Nixus mods. They're a pretty good one. There's so many updated and literally the first page, 270 results. So there's so many in abundance. You've got Ronaldo's face, the peak of football, the Spanish mod, German leagues, better goalkeeper. You can get the Brazilian national team for this one. There's literally an abundance of, of ones to choose from. But for the sake of this video, we went for the peak of football classic mods, where I think there's basically just icons from different eras, not just the normal icons, but just other icons as well from other for other games. So once you click on it, there's all about the mods, all the players that are there. Then you go to manual download and obviously you need to be logged in before you're able to download it. So now I'll now log in. So obviously once it's downloaded, you look for it in the download cursor and it should be, look for peak of football. You can even go to the download folder and you can see the peak of football classic mod is there. Make sure to double click it and then this appears and then make sure to select peak of football by Neon version one. This bit, basically, this other bit basically does mod faces for the players that are, like Neymar and Ronaldo that are in the mod as well. But for some reason, it just doesn't work on this version, but it, the rest will work. And also make sure to extract the file so you've got everything about the mod and also place it in another folder. So there's another mod here, has everything that you need. Oh, so this is very important. Copy and paste the squad file and put it into the appropriate settings file for where you put, um, for where you put a uh, career mode, uh, saved files and obviously if you read this information it tells you everything you need to do to actually get the mod to work so you can just read that in your own time all right so once that's sorted make sure to press tick on the appropriate mods on the right hand side and then once you're ready to actually start using the mod press that launch button to actually get it started and yeah you're good to go pretty much all right so i'm now on fifa no fc25 and i'm going to show you what this mod is all about just to double check that is working. So go to load squads, go to the peak of football, uh, football uh, classic mods, and you can see that the kits have changed. So that's how you know that the mod is working and you see the type of players that they have. So Ronaldo, Bale's there, but they've got completely different and Benzema's there, but you can see the, the actual menu picture is completely different. Modric is there, Casemiro's there, Casillas, Roberto Carlos, and Barcelona as well, prime Barcelona, pr Messi, Laudrup, you know, you've got Indigo Martinez, Rivaldo, Clivert, Danny Alves, so, so many icons, not even icons in the game, but players from previous games in the past or former legends of the club were there as well. So yeah, try this, tr literally try this method on any type of mod that you can get access to and that's available on Nexus mods. But yeah, in a nutshell, this is pretty much how I'm able to get more exclusive kind of more unique content for my videos N not gonna lie if you're using console to play fc24 career mode you're kind of missing out if you're a career mode fan i would recommend the pc more than a console kind of person if you're ultimate team this doesn't really matter but as a career mode fan you have to get the pc to maximize that experience all right guys thanks for watching my video for the tutorial on how to get mods and uh, i'm gonna see you later for another bfa games video all right, peace.